I'm really excited about the partnership that we're servicing with the Mecklenburg County Sheriff's. I think it's very important that our students are exposed to the quality of individuals that work within our resources in the surrounding county area, as well as law enforcement. I think this partnership with McCoy Mentors is definitely going to help bridge that gap between law enforcement and students and give students an opportunity to see that these are real people servicing our community every day. So with this mentorship, it's part of what we're doing this whole school year is about establishing leadership and building that foundation for each and every one of our scholars to make it to the next level and be exposed to many of our partners in the community that's out here to basically service us and keep us safe and protected. I am Chief White and I oversee um, about 80 to 85 percent of the Sheriff's Office. I oversee our detention center, arrest processing center, our classification and records center, and our ACA division. I'm, I'm Officer Payne. I'm a detention officer. I'm currently assigned to B shift. So I work um, the night shift. It's from 6.30 p.m. to 7 a.m. Um, I oversee just watching the residents um, on a daily basis, showering, feeding, um, visiting with their families and things of that such. I am Detention Officer Rosehead and I um, am assigned to A shift, which is day shift, and from 6.30 to 7 p.m. And I oversee the safety and security of um, residents currently in classification units where they are housed until they are classified by classification uh, department to be sent to other part. I'm Officer Russell. I am a Behavioral Health Unit Programs Officer. I've been doing that for about three years now. And we oversee the, the residents who are in the facility trying to better themselves with programs and everything. And I love it. Okay, can you guys tell us what your goals are? What your goals are here at Sugar Creek and why is it important to you guys? In my opinion, it's important because, well, first of all, let me say this. I love kids. I love being around kids. I have a 19-year-old son, uh, and I, I want to come here because I want to share what I have with you guys. I want to make sure that you have uh, a clear understanding exactly what law enforcement do. And uh, I also want to make sure that when you leave Sugar Creek Charter, there are bigger and better things waiting on you. And I want to share experience with you. I want to spend time with you. And I just want to see what your mindset is uh, so that I can help you in any way that I can. I think it's a good decision for anybody because it's a stressful career, but it is also rewarding in the same sense as if you can make a difference in one person's life, it's worth it. I think it's a, actually a great career. Um, it shows, uh, it's a career that shows the community that it's a positive side to law enforcement. Um, there's a, a, a wealth of benefits and, um, and the pay is not bad. <laughs> and you can um, further your education and you can, it just doesn't stop on the day you get, the first day you get into law enforcement, you can go further. Uh, for me, I absolutely love my job. Um, I came from the military on and moved into law enforcement and I don't know, every day it's something new, you know, of course you have your day-to-day your -day things that are gonna, are gonna happen, but um, I enjoy my job. Like Officer Rose has said, the money is really good. Um, and there's, <laughs> there's room for growth all the time. You yeah. don't have to be stuck in one position. You can move up, learn new things. There are, are it's, everything is there for you. So I would say it's, a, it's an awesome career to have. I totally agree with each and every one of them. So I've been with the Sheriff's Office for 29 years. So apparently I love something about it. Uh, I love my job. I love being around people. I'm a people person, a very caring person. Um, so, and, but I have to say this, law enforcement is not for everyone. It's not for everybody. But one thing I can say, it, it's a career or it's a position to where you have the ability to change lives all over, globally. Not just locally, but globally. And a lot of people don't understand that. So I think, you know, I wouldn't say that um, law enforcement officers are all heroes, but what I can say, they have the ability to have that and also make heroes out of others. 